This is an action game like you've never seen before. The team here at Radical are open world specialists. We, we went a lot deeper in story than most games ever even consider going. We do not allow any restraints from 3D to hinder any creativity in this room. We've been doing this kind of game. Scarface, Hulk, Simpsons Hit and Run. These are all open world games, so we're real specialists in this area. think you were put here for a reason. Black Watch is a special forces branch of the US military. They're top secret, they're beyond top secret. They're set up specifically to deal with biological outbreaks. These are the guys that will go in, wipe out entire families, neighborhoods, buildings, and not bat an eye on it. They are completely convinced that what they are doing is right, and that they are the last line of defense against what they are fighting. A viral outbreak starts in New York and various neighborhoods of the city become no-go zones and basically they're brought in to clean up the mess. And the poor Marines have no idea what's going on, but the Black Watcher are sinister, effective, they know exactly what the virus does um, and they're on the lookout for both the player character and other things infected with the virus. The Black Watch are constantly developing weapons through the story of the game to counter the player's abilities in prototype. So they're not just a static force, they're not just a snapshot at the start of the game which uh, they roll more and more guys in through the game. Once they start realizing and analyzing what the player can do, they deploy new technologies to the field. So they'll hunker down, they'll get heavier weapons on you, they won't run. They're used to things like this, they've seen it before. The specialist is Black Watch's best. Uh, we wanted a human foe that Alex could face directly and have a chance of losing. Uh, we call him the uh, right man for the wrong job, the, the ultimate bad guy that comes out in the field when Alex has uh, revealed himself too much. He's dealt with things like Alex before. What makes someone want to become a Black Watch soldier? Uh, are they just brutal killers? Are they uh, humanitarians? Do I shoot the innocent? because I'm crazy or do I shoot the innocent to protect them because the virus is going to be worse. So we start there of what is the mindset behind these soldiers who are Black Watch? What does it take to become a Black Watch soldier? Well, they're a pretty terrifying bunch of people, not just to the player, but also to the inhabitants of New York. Germany in 1932, you know, when they set up their uniforms, they, none of it was an accident. They set it up to look intimidating. And, and a force to be reckoned with. And we did that with Black Watch, uh, that we started with their helmets, their clothes, what is that material, what are their boots, are they running, are they jogging, or do they need these big killer kick-ass boots to bat, bust down doors? And Kev here could probably show you a couple examples of what I'm talking about. The, the idea behind these guys is they have to look scary. So what I did was just to make them a little bit more scary, I remove the eyes, remove the face so you don't have that sort of connection to the to the to the more sort of human aspects. So you can't ever see the face so you get right away the the feeling that you cannot reason with these people, that they're almost subhuman, um, cold, ruthless. You know, they they don't have any qualms about taking extreme action to uh, to deal with the problem at hand. And I think they represent in our game themes of government overreaching its power in a, in a state of crisis. I mean, clearly that's a theme in our game. And the player is going to be reacting to that and seeing kind of the extreme representation of what that might happen if it happened on U.S. soil. There's the old saying, you know, fight not with monsters lest you become a monster. I mean, um, you have to become your enemy to win. Um, you know, biological weapons are unforgiving. They don't care about families. They don't care about uh, loved ones, men, women, children, interrelationships, it just spreads. That's all it does. And...